Howdy. So in this video, I'm going to show why you are probably pricing your PPVs too low. Hey, I'm Bjorn Olsen from YourOFEmpire.com and the Empire Forums, owner of the OnlyFans Empire, an OnlyFans management agency managing girls in the top 1% from all over the world completely remotely, hence different hotel rooms and pets and all my different videos. Check us out at YourOFEmpire.com or at YourOFEmpire on all major social media platforms. But for now, let's get back to the video. Girls, I'm looking at you. All right, so you'll see here a tip menu. This is one of many tip menus that you'll find lying around. I found this one on a Facebook group called OnlyFans Shoutout for Shoutout. And I just want to pull up an example of what not to do. All right, so you see here, you see on this tip menu, it's got pics and vids, photos, chatting role play. First of all, it looks like a shop, but oh, that's for another time. I'll get to that in a minute. So see here, photos, set of three, five bucks. So you get three lingerie photos for five bucks. I have one thing to say to that. All right, in this window, you'll see Walmart. Now, if we scroll down, check this out. You'll see key rings, all right? So you get key ring, $2.70, $8.90, $3.80. What I'm trying to say is that it's all about the perceived value. Now, in this instance, so on this tip menu on OnlyFans, you are selling your naked body. And guess what? If you charge $5 for three picks, that's less than $2 each, and you are giving off the perceived value, which is the equivalent to this key ring that you'll see here. Now, imagine when you're going to Walmart, you're going to Kmart or whatever, you purchase something for three bucks, right? Maybe it's a chocolate bar or a key ring. Say if you drop it on the road, it gets run over, or you accidentally leave it behind. Chances are you're not gonna run back and get it because you don't care. It was three bucks. Drop it on the road, gets run over. Oh no, oh no, it was three. They don't, you don't care. Now, this is the type of perceived value you're giving off when you're selling your naked body for this type of price. Now, there's a couple of reasons why I do not recommend this. First reason is you're having to sell more to get the same amount. If you price high, I'm stating the obvious here, if you price high, you can sell to less people and make more. Second reason is you're giving off a perceived value. You don't want to give off the impression that you're trashy. You want to give off the impression that you're hard to get, that you need to pay a premium to see you without those clothes on. Thirdly, this tip menu here gives the impression of a shop. It's going to make it hard to convert, especially if you're using dating apps. Guys are going to see you on dating apps, go to your OnlyFans, and then they want to see, they want to get to know the girl a bit more. They want to see behind the closed doors. But if they see a tip menu, especially a cheap tip menu, well, it's going to feel a bit like eBay. And then that kind of, that wanting to get to know this girl next door type of buzz goes away. So there are three things wrong with that. Now, I pulled up a couple of examples in this Facebook group that I was showing you at the start. First one is here. This is not a model of mine. If you've seen my other videos, you'll know that I don't show models of mine. I don't show any information of ours because you can only assume as I get bigger, there's going to be some bad actors and some repos that are going to see this. So you'll see here, this is what pretty much what you should do. <laughs> so check this out. So earnings, amount, 30 bucks. There you go. That's a message. 30 bucks a message. 30 bucks a message. 50 bucks for a message. 100 bucks for a tip. 50 bucks for a tip. 150 for a tip. The same guy, that's Chris, I don't know him. I'm just saying in the industry, we call that a whale. See that? He's tipped 250 bucks there in what? 20 minutes, that's a whale. But still, look, 30 bucks for a subscription, 30 bucks for a message, 20 bucks for a tip. That's what you want. That's what you want. You don't want none of this $5 for three picks, sexting, $9 for 10 minutes. So you divide that up, what's that? A dollar for a minute of your time? Hell no, 20 bucks for a minute of your time, more like it. So you just gotta up there. Look, if you add a zero onto this, so you'll see here, photos, lingerie, three picks, three for 50, still too cheap, still too cheap. Now you're gonna say to me, yeah, but not many guys will buy it and not many, not many people will stay subscribed, they'll expire because the prices are too high. Good, think of it like this. If you charge higher pricing, it's like a qualifier. So if a guy purchased for that price, they are now qualified to get your time. They are now qualified to chat with you. They are now qualified to go through these sexting scripts because then you know you're not wasting your time on a brokey. Now, another example is this. Subscription price, same type of thing. None of this $3, check this out. 
Three dollars. What the fuck? I found this on um, OnlyFans. Oh, sorry, on Google, and this is even worse. So look, it's three bucks here. Check this out. It's three dollars. She does not sell PPVs. Now she's probably thinking to herself, "I got six k likes. Boom, I'm popular." Well, that's cool, but six k likes means nothing when you're not selling PPVs. You're charging three bucks. Three bucks for a subscription. Don't do that. I normally charge between 15, 18, depending on the attractiveness, depending on the perceived value that the model is giving off on the social media or that you're giving off on your social media. Don't do this. This is, what's this? This person is charging 40 bucks for a subscription. subscription. That's a bit much. That's going down the other end. You want 15 to 18 because the money doesn't really, you don't care about the subscription money. That should just be what, like less than 10% of the earnings. That is just a qualifier as well. So the subscription price is essentially a qualifier. And then once they pay that, you know they're not a brokey. And then you can slam them with like $30 picks, $50 one minute videos. You think I'm lying? Oh, hell no. So anyway, I just wanted to pull this up and tell you, girls, don't be a key ring, all right? And that's it. So if you like the video, go smash the like button, smash the subscribe button, and I'll see you on another video. The ultimate hub for only fans success.